Our business is all about producing the imagery for Bing Maps. The imagery is made up of the road vector network, which is the road map that looks traditionally like the road atlas that you drive around with in your car. We also produce four imagery types that are aerial, satellite, oblique, or bird's eye, and street side imagery. As you can imagine, that imagery takes a lot of processing power to produce that. We're taking a uh, complete photograph of the entire United States and Western Europe. And we're doing that over two years. And we have 10 very large cameras that take a 220 megapixel picture every two seconds. And they fly every day, seven days a week. And that data comes into our Longmont site and we turn out a peak about four terabytes an hour, 12 terabytes replicated, 24 hours a day, seven days a week, 52 weeks per year. So the challenge that we faced was how to bring on additional capacity to support our current and future site goals from a production standpoint and how we could do that at the lowest cost in the least amount of time with the smallest amount of downtime to our business unit. If we put a dollar into the data center, it means we can't put a dollar into an airplane taking pictures or a dollar into a car driving the roads. And in our business, we need to get as much coverage up on the site as possible. So we're very driven to keep our, what we view as an overhead cost, the data production, down to an absolute minimum. Why did we choose Dell? Well, it was really simple. Cost, technical acumen, and the folks that were delivering the solution. The difference this solution made to our company business was really cost. We went from a one megawatt consumption on power to about 180 to 200 kilowatts per hour on a per quadrant basis. So that means that one container consumes one-fifth the power of what our traditional or legacy containers consumed previously. We also were able to reduce our overall site cost by 8x as compared to traditional data center methods. Now we've kind of been the uh, experimenters at Microsoft. We were the first in our company three years ago to deploy containers when everyone thought we were crazy to do it. And uh, this is the next in our legacy of experimentation where now instead of containers being near us, we have it located at a very uh, cost-effective, almost harsh site that's 20 miles away from us where we can uh, uh, do all our processing very cheaply. We chose this particular solution because it was very obvious to us from the beginning when we were in the room with their engineering team that they were willing to be flexible uh, and they were willing to design in a way that didn't cost us a bunch of extra money for things that we didn't necessarily need. And they were also very willing to go down an untraditional path, which was where we were headed from a capital standpoint. They did an excellent job delivering what they said they were going to do, actually getting the compute delivered to the site within three weeks or less. And we really looked at every single nut and bolt to decide if we really needed it or just want it. And uh, if we couldn't find a reason why we absolutely needed it, we basically asked for it to be removed. So we concentrated a cost at every single turn. And the best thing that in the process was the Dell team never objected or blanched at that and worked with us every inch of the way once they understood our business and why it was so critical to it.